What does a weight loss surgeon have to say about yoga? Well, this was the precise question that I was asked yesterday when I was at a dinner meeting giving a talk to GPs about bariatric surgery and its role in managing the epidemic of obesity in our society. Now, some of you may not know this, but I'm a certified yoga and a meditation teacher. I don't take yoga classes anymore. I used to do that once upon a time, but I have maintained my teaching and my ongoing education to keep up with my registration as a yoga and meditation teacher. Now, the question that I was asked was, what do I tell my patients who are coming to see my opinion or coming to seek my opinion for bariatric surgery because of excess weight issues or diabetes and sleep apnea and high blood pressure and other related issues. Well, I can tell you one thing. If I uttered the word yoga in front of my patients, that's just going to scare them and they're going to run away. So here is what I say to them. And this is something which resonates with them. And this is at the core of what yoga is all about. The word yoga comes from the Sanskrit uh, root word, which is called union, the union of the mind and the body. And that's precisely what yoga does. It creates a mind-body awareness. And I'll give you one example. And if you start applying it into your life today, well, I can tell you, you will start to see results. The concept is very simple. When you bring mind-body connection into your dining table or whenever you are having a meal, I tell them that eat your meal without being distracted, not in front of TV screens, not while watching your Instagram or your TikTok videos. You just enjoy the sensation of the food. And when you're satisfied, learn to say thank you. So what yoga is doing is it's not really yoga, but it is really the mind-body awareness. Now, I don't care whether you call it yoga or Tai Chi or Qigong. All of these techniques are creating a present moment awareness. And when you have present moment awareness, you naturally make healthy choices. And as they have said, the quality of your, of your life is a direct reflection of the quality of choices you are making. Start making different choices and your life will take a turn. So put this concept into your life today and do share with me in the comment section below as to how did you incorporate this one facet of yoga, which is the primal facet of creating that mind-body awareness in your life. Take care and stay safe.